You're all welcome again to my YouTube channel. I'm still your girl Takurov, aka the Queen of Sumuti. Yes, to my subscribers, I say thank you guys so so much. Thank you all so much for your support. I really do appreciate. For those who have not subscribed, please do that. Those who have not turned on the notification bell, please, you have to do that. So each time I upload a video, I will not have to share the video with you, but your notification is going to signal you that that could have uploaded a new video. So continue to share my videos. Always turn, always press the like button. The like button, not this one, but this. is going to help me a lot. I say thank you all so much. Today I want us to bake. I want us to do another baking today. So let's go straight to our kitchen and start our bake. So to start with this, our sweet bread recipe, I'm going to add 80 grams of butter into my flour. I'm going to use my clean hands. My hands are clean. And rub the, 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 the butter into the flour. So that is the first step. So I forgot to tell you guys I'm using 450 grams of, of bread flour. You can still use all purpose flour. So after rubbing my butter into my flour, I'm going to be adding my several grams of yeast. That should be one pack. One packet of it. I'm going to be adding my 80 grams of sugar. My three eggs. Guys, I'm sitting down because I'm not feeling too well. You can hear from my voice. I'm also going to add my 100 grams of, of milk. Why I'm adding my milk, I'm mixing. I'll add my half tablespoon of non milk at once so I could so I will mix everything together. Guys, right, you have to mix it so so guys, this is our bread mixture. I ended up adding another half cup of flour because when I mixed everything, I realized my, my dough was still very soft. I added another half cup of flour into it. So when you mix, I realized that dough is still soft. You add another half cup of flour. So right now, I'm going to cover this bread for it to increase in size while I do the, the bread filling. So I'm going... So for the bread filling, you need 250 grams of dark chocolate. I'm using this. 150 grams of it. I'm going to chop them into smaller halves. I'm also going to be using this dry food. I'll chop them as well into smaller halves. So I'm done chopping my, my dark chocolate and And my dry fruits I'm going to be adding this into the chocolate I'm going to be adding four tablespoons of honey this is four tablespoons of honey into I was supposed to use orange jam, but I couldn't find orange jam around me, so I decided to use honey. So if you can find orange jam around you, orange jam is the best. I'm so guys, I'm rolling my bread. So right now, I'm going to be adding my fillings into my bread.
as you can see I've filled my bread already I've filled my bread with the fillings I made so now I'm going to be rolling I'll carry this and roll again. Hope you guys have seen what I'm doing. After finish rolling my bread, I'm going to cut. This is my baking pan. It's already greased with butter. Guys, can you see? I'm finished cutting the bread. So right now, I'm going to keep this to rest for another 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, we are going to be baking. So it's 15 minutes already. Right now I'm going to be brushing with egg. So after brushing, I'm going to be baking now in my oven 200 degree to golden brown so we've come to the end of our today's recipe as you can see it came out so well guys this is beautiful if you do this at home your kids will really love it the entire family is going to love it it's so nice so Thank you all so much for joining me again today. Try this recipe at home. I tell you, you will love it. Keep sharing my videos. Keep watching my videos. Like, subscribe if you have not yet done that. And God will bless you. Thank you all so much. And do have a blessed day. Ciao.